Hello, my name is Peter Škabla. I'm CFD support engineer and in this video I will show you different mesh setups with ideas how to improve mesh quality if it's not ok. For this video tutorial I'm using a radial compressor example from our website and I will focus on meshing impeller component. Let's start with first setup. Meshing parameters can be changed in section components. The most important parameter is background mesh size. This parameter determines size of cells in a mesh volume. I will start with 2 mm cubes. I can show background mesh size via frame to see if it, the values are reasonable. I will leave default wall refinement values for now, so I can go to TCFD manager and start meshing process. I started TCFD manager. After I wrote the case with write case button, I pressed build and waited until TCFD meshes impeller. Now it's done and after I hide component and press show, I will see the mesh. I can choose surface with edges to see not only volume but also cells. It is visible that this mesh is very coarse and not usable for TCFD computation. I'll, I will get back to TCFD setup and refine it more. TCFD setup can be shown again by clicking on radial compressor.tcfd line. Let's head back to background mesh size. Good starting point for background mesh size is to take diameter of the impeller, which in my case is 62 mm, and divide it by 75. This simple formula gives me new background mesh size around 0.8 mm. I will use it. Now I'm going to remesh the impeller to see the difference. But first I need to press apply to apply the changes. After finishing new setup, I clicked on TCFD manager, wrote changes with write case button and remesh the case with build button. Now I have much better looking mesh, but I need to check for smaller details if it is really ready for the computation. At first, I need to look at the geometry from different angles. Now I will hide edges to see only surface. When I do this, I see that geometry or the mesh is not really smooth near blades. Refinement of background mesh size worked well for the mesh volume, but this time I will need to improve mesh on the walls and for that I will modify refinement levels on the walls. So let's head back to TCFD setup. Refinement level values are in table patches. In this table, there is a list of all STLs used for meshing. STLs which are used for meshing of impeller have green background. I said I want to improve mesh near blade walls and that is why I increase refinement level values on blades. I increase these values from 1 to 3, both minimum and maximum refinement levels. This should do the trick and I will head back to TCFD manager and mesh the geometry one more time. Meshing is now complete and this time I see that edges around blades are much smoother. I will look at my geometry one more time if I don't see any additional problems.
I can show surface with edges again. No, it looks okay. So I'm done. And this is how you visually check if your mesh is okay. If you have any problems with your geometry, then you can refine parameter background mesh size to refine the volume or refine walls with higher refinement levels. Thank you for watching this video tutorial. If you have any questions, please write us to support at cfdsupport.com.